Okay, people, welcome back. Oh, man. Feeling like I'm... I think... So we finished Goku and Vegeta's story modes. Up until this point, we still gotta go back and do all the what-ifs and all that. But, um... We got four more people to cover. And for one, I'm to understand, their, their stories aren't that long. So we might be able to get through at least a couple of them tonight. Um... So let's just jump into Gohan's cool. let's get perspective. Mm. Oh, he, they start his, his off in the hyperbolic time chamber. Truth be told, he didn't really start fighting until... No, no, he had a fight with, uh, with Frieza that they didn't cover. Like they just jumped straight to, straight to this. Androids would appear, yada yada. Goku get the heart virus. Even more androids awaken. The situation changed rapidly after several days. And Goku's suggestion he and Gohan decided to train in a hyperbolic time chamber. I'm assuming this is where his first fight is. Wow, it's so bright in here. I do not have my graphics set to high at all. Heavy. It's kind of hard to breathe. Yep, and not only that, but once this door is closed. We're completely cut off from contact with the outside world. Go take a look out back. That's the training area. You'll see the reason why I barely made it a month in here when I was a kid. Oh, this is crazy. How could this be inside a room? It's bigger than the whole lookout. It's just a huge, empty space. And it goes on and on like this in every direction. Try not to wander off too far, okay? might not be able to find your way back yeah right and we we've got to stay a year huh come on we've got to get to work right away first off we should get started on turning you into a super saiyan a super saiyan me i don't know i mean do you really think i can well sure why not i can do it and you're my son aren't you we'll spend some time teaching you how to transform and then we'll be able to get into the real training. Oh, I like how they allow you to... Uh, yeah. uh, Told you. It's pretty intense, right? Gravity training takes some getting used to if you've never done it before. Just keep at it. Your body will adjust. Okay, Dad. Good. At this rate, he's gonna turn on even stronger than I hoped he would. <laughs> <laughs> Believe in yourself. Right. Continue the training still absorbs the other androids, reaching new heights of power. When they finish training, as the hyperbolic time chamber, Goku, Gohan and Goku are told of a martial arts tournament, the cell games, to be held in nine days. 
the day of the cell games from the rise and the warriors gathered a challenge cell in its perfect form first person to volunteer to fight goku the fight is goku which is another standing all key generated but as he looks on gohan notices that he alone has a different understanding of what's happening suddenly goku puts a halt to the battle to surprise everyone he announces his surrender yet that is not the only shocking thing he says Oh, this is when he threw the Sinzu Bean. Time for you to take over, Gohan. Me take him on? I don't know. This is madness, Goku. There's no way the boy can win. I'll admit, Gohan's abilities are far beyond what they used to be. But you're pitting him against a foe even you couldn't beat. Listen, you have to trust me. Gohan has a power within him that's greater than anything you could possibly imagine. So what do you think? You see me hit Cell with anything you couldn't handle? Have you seen me go at him with anything you don't have? Well, no, I don't think so. But you were both holding back, right? I'm sure it'd be a lot different if you were going all out. Now, I don't know about Cell, but I was giving it everything I had. You thought I was holding back you were gauging my energy against your own. <laughs> Gohan, answer me. Is this true? Yeah. All right, Gohan. This is it. I need you to go out there and win this one for us, okay? Then we can all go home. Okay, Dad. I'll do it. real mad things would happen around me that I couldn't explain crazy things oh, a fascinating story but unwise to tell if you intend to intimidate runt it helps to know a bit about your audience first case in point let's just say for the sake of argument it's true you have huge reserves of power. And let's just say I'm the sort who wants to see them firsthand. Interested in drawing out Gohan's true power cell since I'm flying with a punch. Gohan fights back, but his rage has not yet conquered his will. Cell continues to inflict pain on Gohan in an attempt to draw his anger. When Gohan's pain does not generate enough rage to push him beyond his lit cell, decides to switch targets to Goku and the others. Do not come any closer. It is highly unlikely you could survive such a blast. I am going to self-destruct and take Cell with me. <laughs> such a shame, Android 16. But then a mere bomb wouldn't have been enough to destroy me anyway. Oh, 16, looks like you joined the lengthy list of Dr. Giro's failures. What in the world is that thing? 
Pay attention, little ones. Time to make them suffer. <laughs> Gohan, listen to me. There are some foes who cannot be reasoned with. You are allowed to fight on the side of justice. Seize upon your anger. Wield it like a weapon. I understand your reluctance, but holding it in is pointless. That is sound advice. Better than I expected from an appliance. But I'd much rather tear the rage out of him. Go on. I love the animals and everything about nature. Protect them for me. <laughs> it's time Smash. to can it, you worthless scrap. You got what you wanted, and I'll never forgive you! So your true power has finally revealed itself. Perfect. Now we can get down to the business. Don't get comfortable, boy. Even with luck on your side, the odds of beating me are hardly in your favor. You're wrong. Yes, that's the spirit. Too bad you're going to lose it once you witness me in all my terrifying glory. How can anyone on this measly planet possess so much power? Go on! What are you doing? Finish him! It's all up to you! What, do you want me to end it already? <laughs> I'm not letting him off that easy. He deserves to feel the same pain he put all his victims through. <laughs> Am I seeing things, or did he just puke up 18? What? Now I actually feel sorry for you. Uh, 
in a few moments. I'll blow myself to bits. <laughs> I might die, but then so will all of you. This planet will explode in a burst of flame. If you lay a finger on me, boom! Bye-bye, Earth! No sense in wasting your last few seconds while you got them. <laughs> <laughs> I... I know that look. Sorry, I've thought this over, guys. Well, any way you slice it, there's only one way to save Earth. Goodbye, my friends. Uh, goodbye? You're not thinking of... Goku! No! You did good today, Gohan. Made me proud. Dad, what are you... Tell your mom I'm sorry. I'm not gonna make it home this time. His energy, it's gone without a trace. Dad! All of a sudden, the sale went big boom. The fact that the victory came at the cost of Goku's life He's heavily on Gohan's shoulders. He can escape us, us the shadow of regret. Within, the ground begins to rumble from the dust. A flash of light shoots out and pierces trunks in the chest. What appears to be, what appears before them is Cell, but someone who's grown even more powerful than before. With Cell self-destructive, he protected his core from damage, allowing him to regenerate. It is the revived Cell who struck down trunks fight begins once again. T Trunks! <laughs> Surprised to see me. <laughs> Something amuse you? Does imminent destruction put a smile on your face? It was because of my mistake that Dad had to sacrifice himself. It's my fault you put us in that position. I'd have given anything for a chance to do it over again. Now I get one. Then let's see if you've got the power to back up your words. Luck won't be on your side this time. You won't survive this time. I am done playing games. It's time I ended this. It's a... Too slow. You won't survive this time! Get it. Uh, 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 uh. 
too slow. You won't survive this time. Too slow. You won't survive this time. Too slow. You fool. Too slow. Too slow. Forget it. You won't survive this time. Anyone's going to defeat Cell, it's going to be me! This is when Vegeta went cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs. Having lost Trunks to do or die for Vegeta as he confronts Cell and pours all into his power, all of his power in his attacks. However, even after consecutive energy blast from Vegeta, Cell still stands unharmed. Vegeta then collapses from Cell's counterattack just as Cell moves in for the kill. Gohan dies in the last minute, costing him the use of his left arm. Vegeta is in sight it's for Cell, who gathered enough key to annihilate the entire solar system. It's about to fire his attack at Gohan Please and the others. Forgive me, Dad. Earth is doomed, and it's all my fault. Just as Gohan is about to give up, a voice reaches him somewhere in the unknown. It's the voice of Goku speaking in from Underworld. Hey! Don't go giving up now! That's not the Gohan I know! Dad? Is... Listen to me! I promise you can beat him! You just gotta believe in yourself, Gohan! Right now... You're the strongest person in the whole universe! R right! I'll see you in hell! <laughs> I'll put this to rest. Goodbye! Didn't skip the dial. <laughs> Thanks to Gohan's victory over Cell, the Earth is saved and the battle is finished. Gohan and the others suggest reviving Goku with the Dragon Balls, but that wish cannot be granted. Go Goku has already accepted his fate and announced that he's going to stay in the other world. Gohan and his friends were grown so much from the battle as they mourn the loss of Goku. They return to their daily life on a peaceful earth. There were no what-if scenarios to be had in there.
this one before. 